Shape baby, Shape, baby. You, you wavy, you fire, you driving me crazy. Mm. Your respect, you demand it. Turning out with all your bitches, and I swear you the baddest. Hey, sweeties, you already know who it is. You heard it in the intro, and I'm back with another video. So today's video, as you can tell by the title of the video, it's another sanity check with mcdonald's breakfast i love mcdonald's breakfast let me just get into that okay so what we have is some hot cakes a biscuit eggs and some bacon with a hash brown y'all know what come in it and then i got some orange juice today's topic is going to be about progression so when i say progression i mean progressing under pressure being lazy just anything in all honesty we all have to progress no matter what we go through so with your mental health issues whether you have anxiety depression bipolar disorder whether you're just a simple being and you just are lazy because I, I got mental issues and i'm lazy so i'm fighting two different demons okay mm. Muy bueno. okay y'all i don't like the fact that they put the biscuit in there like right on top of the egg it's like egg but um and then all the pieces of bacon are pieces literal pieces like i'm a baby when you're going through something you always need to still try to think about your future what you do now affects your future greatly without the now there is no future without the past there is no present so you always have to remember that, that no matter what you're going through, you have to stick it out. And I know I'm just kind of being kind of bland and I might sound a little mean, but you have to, okay? So. Y'all, yeah, this is just so good. I always choose the best stuff. Now, in all honesty, guys, I have no clue what I'm going to title this video. But I do know that it will have something to do with pushing through and progression something like that this is kind of a tip video so there's a saying that says diamonds are made under pressure which is true you have to go through the bad days to get to the good days you might have a few good days but they're mostly going to be bad so hey sweeties um i know this is kind of weird to see right now um i'm sorry to stop the video um i know i keep saying um right now i'm so sorry but i had a family emergency so literally right in the middle of the video in the last clip you saw me grab my phone um and i got a text and i had to i had to go handle some things um i'm okay but it was really important um it's been two days since i last talked to you all i will finish the video today today is actually tuesday the day that i'm releasing the video um, so I do apologize for being late. I apologize for not eating with you all, uh, continuing breakfast. I apologize for changing my attire. I mean, whatever you guys feel is different about this vibe that's about to happen, I do apologize. I'm in a way better mood now, though, and everything's going smooth as it can be. So I'm ready to get back into this video. Um, I started recording the video on Sunday. It's Tuesday now, uh, obviously, release date. But, um, yeah, I just had to stop instead of just skipping to a whole nother outfit and everything. I just had to let you all know what was going on because I wasn't, I'm not going to be eating. I'm just going to talk. I'm just going to finish up the video. Uh, the video is about to be maybe another four or five minutes. Um, so yeah, thank you all for staying patient with me. Um, and I hope you all enjoy the rest of the video. I hope you enjoyed the beginning. I guess you can kind of tell in the video that I was a little off, a little um, hesitant and a little, you know, a little standoffish looking around and stuff. But um, I'm back and I'm ready to finish. So let's get back into this video. Welcome back. And once again, I apologize for abruptly leaving you all. But I'm ready to get back into this video now. I believe where I left off was I was talking about how diamonds were made under pressure and you have to go through the bad days. And I don't think that I really hit too much on that. So what I meant was bad days don't last. 
but they are needed for your specific journey. Meaning where you're supposed to end up in life, you're going to go through the things that you're supposed to go through. You're going to go through the hardships that you're supposed to go through. You get what I'm saying? For me, a lot of my hardships have been having to deal with people talking about me or disrespecting me. I got to kind of learn how to calm down. <laughs> So, because, you know, when you're getting into the world of social media, people are going to talk. No matter what you do, what you say, people are going to talk. So, I'm learning how to calm myself and not take things so seriously, you know what I mean? So, if you're dealing with something traumatizing per se to you, just think about what, what does this usually come with? Like I said, if you find yourself being teased and taunted, maybe that's getting you ready because you want to be in the social media world. Or, you know, maybe it's putting you through something because you want to be a psychiatrist. So it had to put you through something to learn something to even want you to be that. You get what I'm saying? Just focus on your journey, though. Focus on you. Which leads me into my next uh, little bullet point thingy. If it makes you happy, do it. It doesn't matter what you want to do. Like I said, people are going to talk. People are going to put that pressure on you. Hey, do this. Hey, do that. Hey, I think this looks better. Hey, I don't like that. There's always going to be an opinion in the world. You just have to fight through it and do what makes you happy every time. Being different or the same as, as everyone else in the world, it doesn't matter. We, we all get pressure put on us. You got to stand on being yourself. And that's what will get the people, the votes and everything like that. You have to be consistent in being yourself. You have to love you first. It doesn't matter what type of pressure or reality that the world wants to put on you. As long as you yourself, you'll get through it. When you're dealing with pressure, whether it's from your parents down on you at school, whether it's the college administrators telling you you need to do a little bit more to get here, whether it's your own self pressing on you to get to that next level, you have to understand you have to talk to yourself correctly. It doesn't really matter. Like I said, people are going to talk. This all ties in together. People are going to talk. So you have to be the one to talk to yourself correctly. I believe I said this in another video. Be your own hype man. You have to be your own number one fan. Because at the end of the day, no one can love you more than you love yourself. No one knows you more than you love yourself. So why wouldn't you want to talk to yourself, right? Which is something I actually struggle with sometimes. Like right before this video, I had to talk to myself like, girl, get on that camera life happens you're gorgeous you gotta do it like you know there was a little bit of pressure on me before i took this video do i do i look tired does it but does it matter like this page is real this page is to show you all the real you get what i'm saying or is it too late it's the day of can i edit in time and i was like girl you got this you got this <laughs> okay you just have to talk to yourself correctly, hype yourself up. You have to be determined to get to the end goal. You have to find your goal and get there. It's all on you. No one else can make you get there. Yeah, you. they can offer you a deal, but what are you going to do within the deal to keep the deal? You get what I'm saying? So that's just how it goes. Remember when you're dealing with things, if you need to take a break, it is always okay. You don't have to to go and go and go until your ever last dying breath. You can take a break to get there. Just get there. Just do what you need to do to get there. If you need to take a year off of school before you go back to college, do that. If you feel like college isn't where you don't do it, but you always have to put in some type of work, some type of hustle into what you want, into what you want to do. Breaks don't necessarily consist of being lazy. Meditate, write in a journal, while you're on your vacation, write down what you want to do better when you get back. You get what I'm saying? You just always have to be one up on what you want and what you need. So this brings me to the closing of my video. I hope you all enjoyed it. I apologize for not eating with you all the end, but I hope you enjoyed the beginning and I got enough in with you all to make you feel comfortable. If you're not already part of the team, make sure you go hit that subscribe button, follow me on Instagram and become part of the gang. You all have a blessed day and I hope you all enjoyed my video. Bad bitch, you savage. Quit to let that motherfucker know that you're not average. Yeah, Say, yeah. baby. Say, baby. You ain't be.